from WMAR 2 News, Maryland's most accurate forecast. Well, everybody's looking forward to the weekend, and it's going to be one of the warmer weekends we've seen in a while. Warm and breezy tomorrow, lots of clouds, so don't expect to step outside into some sort of bliss. Uh, but it will feel noticeably milder than it was today. Heading into Sunday, that southerly wind really does increase, so we're going to see temperatures flirt with record highs. And unfortunately, there's going to be a chance of a stray morning, early afternoon shower, but I think we're clearing after around 12, keeping it dry and actually quite comfortable for the second half of the day. By Monday, I actually think we're going to top those uh, record highs, and unfortunately, another round of rain is going to push in. Late day, I think that if you have plans for earlier on, you're going to be okay. By 5, we're going to start to see that rain moving into western Maryland, shifting eastward through the evening hours. Here's a look at some dry time. Unfortunately, some cloudy time as well. Winds coming out of the south tomorrow. It's going to be that wind shift that's going to help warm the numbers up. I do expect the clouds to stay around till about five. We'll get some decent sunshine before we uh, lose the sun a couple of hours later. Uh, but that southerly flow is going to keep the numbers even milder heading into the overnight hours. So if you're thinking of getting up early in the morning, maybe running some errands, getting some things done around the house, grabbing some coffee. We're at 37 degrees by the eight o'clock hour. Heading into the 50s as we get into the afternoon. So giving you the green light to strap up those shoelaces, put on that nice hoodie, those tights, or those uh, sweatpants, and go for a nice run. Comfortable numbers for this time of year. Falling back into the lower 50s. Perfect to maybe call the friends over or maybe play some Monopoly with the kids. Anybody still play Monopoly? I love Monopoly. I'm good at it. And as we head towards Sunday and Monday, 76 degrees. That is the mark set in 1935. I think we're going to tie that Monday. 76 is the mark again, but I think we're going to get above that upper 70, 78 degrees, the forecast. So we're going to be very unseasonably warm and we have these southerly winds to talk about. These are going to be gusting up to 40 miles per hour at times as we head into your Sunday afternoon. And that's what's going to send those numbers surging northward, getting into uh, that uh, 25 plus above average area. Here's a look at those showers moving into portions of Pennsylvania at 7 a.m. I'm going to be tracking that line through about 12 and by 12 notice it's about gone. Uh, so we'll see some clearing as we head into the evening hours uh, as those winds out of the south continue to dominate the forecast, which is good for folks that are heading out to uh, the 60th annual St. Patrick's Day Parade. This is in downtown Annapolis. Those spotty showers are not going to be overwhelming, and it actually looks like most of those showers are going to stay north of Annapolis. So I actually am going to give you the green light there. Just be prepared for those warmer numbers as we head into the evening. More rain chances as we head into the evening on Monday as those winds stay elevated, keeping temperatures in the upper 70s, and then we lose 20 degrees degrees heading into Tuesday, all courtesy of a cold front that keeps us in the mid to upper 50s through next Friday.